That's what humans would have to look like in order to survive a car crash. Bro, let's go. You know, child, every day when I get on this app, that stairway to heaven looks a lot more like a slide. Girl, why are the chlamydia meds fucking gorgeous? Better question, why are you so comfortable on the internet? I just felt like that was more deserving of a diary as opposed to a TikTok video. You want to know something that's really gorgeous? A negative test for chlamydia. What in the fuck? Hey, that chip is crazy, but um... Your hand look eligible for social security. Boy, I know you did not just slide them callous concrete conquerors across the ground like that there with no socks or shoes on. That made my feet hurt, bro. Come on now. Oh, no, this can't be. My timbers, they shivered. Hey, quick question. You ever thought about boxing? Because your bob and weave game is immaculate. Do you dodge them? You must have went ultra instinct in the shootout. Well, I'm eating Jolly Ranchers, right? Nah, you don't get to just breeze past that, bro. I know you used to munch on rocks for recreational reasons when you was a baby. You or you out here casually crushing crystallized candy with your canines. Kids with severe spinal or scoliosis deformity may be placed in this weight and pulley system. All right, but look, guys. When you get out the shower, bro, and don't even lie, man, cause you know it's just between us, bro. But like, you, you know, you get out the shower, bro, and you naked, and you, you know, what I'm you look down there, and you try to get them eat your vegetables. You know, I'm probably gonna go to the hill in a pine straw skirt, and I ain't never really liked my vegetables. However, I did give lima beans a try, so one bite good and third. Cornbread. No, no, no. We're going to address that cornbread statement later. Is that a ding -a ring pop in your mouth? You can't even... F what are you hitting him with? You have no... I tried my hardest not to laugh at that video, man, but I couldn't. Y'all know what kind of vengeance you got to have in your heart to try to hit somebody with an arm you ain't even got no more? But it was finna get hit with the, with the phantom skibbity pat. Hey, be like smooth. What, can you teach me how to, you know why, cause I'm, a Small shredder is installed inside the toilet, and the stool is crushed and enters the toilet. That has got to be the stupidest thing I've ever seen in my life, bro. That is a testicle tenderizer right there, dog. As soon as your butt cheeks touch that seat, your balls getting ripped off like a tag on the t-shirt. Welcome to the Salty Spittoon. How tough are you? And then this kid pull up, casually standing on Legos. You know, it's people that dread that happening to him, and he just playing at them. I bet his alarm clock is just a machine that smack his shins with a scooter. That kid probably brushed his teeth with sandpaper and floss with barbed wire. He need to be on the watch list somewhere, because he going to be a problem. Let's see what we got here. Boy, that man, Light McQueen, finna show y'all how to ka -chow. Get on through there, bro. Come on. When you got speed, you going to make it every time. Oh, hell no. You might as well detour right now. Gee, they finna beat the brake pass off this one. Pilt this muffin cap back, Blue. Yup. Hey, man, you just lost your luggage, bro. If you pull over now, you'll save everybody some. And in other news, a driver and passenger were both mauled today. Uh, this part, like, slow and fast at the same time. Definitely not gonna make it. If you or a loved one were injured or suffered death to mesothelioma, you might be entitled to financial compensation. Oh, the big body? Hey, man, you know, slow and steady when the race, bro. I mean, he ain't gonna finish unscathed or nothing like that, but he gonna get through there. Yup, lost a little. But look, man, when you stay true to your path in life, everything gonna work out, G. Just like this here. Try to tell you. Oh, green, that's the color of life. Well, it's easy, dog. Come on, now. I apologize for my outboys, Mr. Wunch Love. Oh, yeah, that black thing. Yeah, for sure. Definitely gonna get there that fast. Come on, now. Speedy. Gonzalez. Alright, bro, he did. It's getting a little personal. Ah, ha, ha, hell, your man's over there looking like an unplugged bathtub, and you laughing? That ain't no friendship, that's a friend kayak at best, man. Let Mother Nature have me in the head, locking you giggling. You better go to the depths of the ocean and call him Poseidon and tell him not to turn me loose, because if he do, it's over with for you. 
we only need to shower two to three times per week. Hey, look, I respect that she board certified and everything, but um, if you're from down south or specifically anywhere near me, she wasn't talking to you, okay? It's hotter than demon dick in a wool condom outside. I don't need you walking around me smelling like buzzard burp after a buffet, all right? Y'all be having Berea tacos, fajita meat, and bell peppers blowing under y'all armpits, fam. I'm gonna need you to take a bath as needed. As soon as you start smelling the stench, as soon as you start accumulating on the Roman bro, go touch some bath water. Targeted, coordinated attacks. I need y'all to understand something. If we're having a snowball fight, and you attack me with a snowman torso, I'm gonna hit you with a deep freezer. That man just reversed a back shot, bro. Like, this is the thing. Back in my day, bro, you could have like regular dance moves. Them still cool. Like, you can really still do that. Like, remember we used to do the wave, bro? He was hitting a robot for real. The same move every time. You can still do that. You can touch if you want to. I don't know if you built like that, but like, for real, you can touch all day. It's easy. It really. Remember people who do the dougie, bro? You feel me? If it nothing. Even this one right here for the folk that can't dance. Just put a little little lean on it. Y'all folk. Y'all tweaking. He just. Remember the, the goddamn. You fit. We used to hit that. Oh, nothing. And then y'all started doing this shit. This shit right here. Every song. Didn't matter. Michael Jackson Thriller, come on, y'all hitting this. Boy, you posted got down. You feel me? Remember Mad Chat had us doing this? Y'all. I'm over it, bro. Oh, 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 somebody help me. That brother just lost his ACL, MCL, CDL, Patella, Nutella, Umbrella. Boy, it's all gone. You know how bad your fall had to be for it to be in installations? That man had three parts to that fall. You know, this video really makes you appreciate modern day technology because at least if somebody drop a bomb on you now, you probably gonna die before you even realize it landed. But back in the day, you know, back when Paul Revere was inventing snitching, boy, they had cannons. You know what I'm saying? You be in the trench with a musket, bro. You done got that ramen noodle packet, tore it open, pour it off in there, stuff it with the stick. You got a little pellet to shoot out. One shot, that's it. You come over the top and a cannon done blew your sternum out your back, head still stationary. Boy, that'll blew the patriotism out of me, man. Don't that make you just appreciate peace? All right, so I'm gonna let y'all know if these folks are gonna survive this little stunting endeavor they doing. So first off, buddy in the back with no seatbelt, he a goner. Yeah, out of there. Turned him into a blade blade. You gotta be smarter than that, my man. Now the moon, this gonna negate some of that fall damage, so they should be okay because you know it's less gravity. That means you got more bounce, a lot less aggressive landing if you or not. They turned that bitch into a boomerang and they not coming back. Now Jupiter, this gonna be a close. Oh, you almost had it. You gotta be quicker than that. They gonna. And in other news, 47 people died today in a bus accident. Uh, Mars, I don't know too much about Mars. Gravity. Oh. Well, I mean, y'all know where Buddy going. I'm going to have to guide his soul to the crossroads. But the rest of them, like, they might just break a shoulder blade or something like that. But like me personally, I just not die. It's just that simple. Uh, the sun, yeah, they're through. They're through. It's going to escalate really quickly. Just like that. Mash taters. They, they gone. Uh, Pluto. You know, honestly, if you're going to die, this seems like a pretty... Pe Hold on, that man Richard going to stay it? Well, he going to stay it? They had to speed it up and everything. I think they're going to make it. I th oh, shit. Yeah. I mean... Oh, that was a very lackluster impact. I think they might pull it off. Uh, she hurt you bad, didn't she, bro? I can just tell, because... Like them was your taste buds. Now they gonna be taste enemies. You you just sensed them like that. Oh yeah, you might as well go ahead and pack it up, fam. You ruined your career before it even started. I mean, if you're a little young, there might be a chance that you know can live a somewhat decent life. But if not, you might want to start practicing proposing on your elbow. You you got something to say? Whoa! <laughs> I'm not going to lie, initially I was finna call CPS. I thought you had struck your child with a bat on the internet. And then I realized that that's just a very realistic doll. And then I realized that that was a very realistic doll. And so I'm going to call the FBI. Yo, they caught that mugshot of Lil TJ Legend's shooter. Let's look at this ugly, goofy ass. That's you. So I get this comment like literally every day. I actually identify as 25. Well, actually, Your Honor, the thing is, I identify as innocent, so you hey, have shut to the fuck up for me. All right. 
25 to life. Uh, I mean, can I at least have the bottom bunk? Hell no. Nah. I don't know who needs to hit us, but send that man a picture of your ass. We are gathered here today to spread the good word. There has been many a days saved by a photograph of the cheeks. I know that's right. Come on now. The yams. Y'all don't hear what I'm saying. Huh? That booty. Send that man a picture of that ass. Now, I don't know another way to say this, so I'm going to shoot it to you straight. From one dreadhead to another. I say this with all the love in the world. My brother, I think it's time, okay? This is an intervention. I have to keep you aware of the situation at hand. That retwist like it was ordered with the bone out. Hmm? Those locks look double spaced and italicized. Okay, it's time for you to join the eight ball brigade, the scout meat militia, uh, the spit shine squadron. That's going to be you. But I, but I tell you this, I tell you this. If you grew out your facial hair and you wear a nice hat, you're still going to look great. I guarantee it. I stand by it. Now, let me tell you something, Jake. You might have had a lot of wine in your time, but you ain't never had fine dining like this here. Okay, I am divine and sharper than the quill on a porcupine. You know what I'm telling you? Right, now, you take you one sip, and I promise she's going to be impressed and undressed by 9 o'clock tonight. I guarantee it. I stand by it. Yeah, look at that tire. Oh, my God. <clears throat> Brother man, I'm going to say this one time, and I ain't going to beg. Keep my name out your mouth unless you want me to give you peace. Now, who am I making this autograph out to? Okay, I'm not going to lie. I might have been tripping that time. I might have been doing a little too much. I might, but, but, but see, they said that curiosity killed the cat, and I'm a dog. Mm -hmm. They didn't say anything about me. So, so by technicality, I really didn't do anything wrong. You know what I'm saying? But I, but I tell you what, I tell you what, if you let it go this one time, we can secure the bond between man and man's best friend, I guarantee it. I stand by it. Okay, I might have been tripping a little bit. I'm not going to lie. You know, as I sit here in this predicament that I put myself in, I think back to what I once heard. Now, someone once told me that the grass was much greener on the other side. But as I sit on the other side, I realize that it ain't nothing but concrete. Okay, I'm a penguin. You know that, right? Nothing but ice cubes, igloos, polar bears, and fish food. And now, I'm stuck in a concrete jungle. But I tell you what, I tell you what. You put me back over that wall, and I'll never take what I have for granted again. I guarantee it. I stand by it. <clears throat> Brother man, you know, for a second there, I was, I was actually for an action for a piece. And I realized them just some dogs. I still got a question, though. And it don't make me beg. Can I pet that dog? I wish I had two stomachs. Then I could eat. Eat lunch twice. <clears throat> Little man, don't you worry. Cause I'm gonna tell you like this, him. If you keep on begging and they keep on giving you peas, you're gonna have more than two stomachs. You're gonna have four necks and an unusually wide back. <laughs> you know how much pain you gotta be in to turn into Arnold Schwarzenegger, bro? That man said, Ha! Get to the doctor now! What do you want? What do you want? Now you look here. I'm gonna need you to let me pet that dog. Oh, come on now, let me pet that dog. You gonna make me beg. Let me pet that little dog. In the night, I hear him talk the coldest story ever told. Somewhere far along this road belongs a soul to a woman so heartless. You say it's your first time? Mm-hmm. Not buying it, pal, not buying it. You one shot at that donut, I have it on film. Oh! I'm not gonna lie to you, child. For a second there, I thought she had, um, began to, you know, but like press record and then post it in on social media for everybody to see. Hashtag rub that thing. I was wrong. You mind if I go pray real fast? It's a bad bitch party. You cannot get in. I can take your man. Pass him. Oh, 
in the Abra Cadabra is this? Clearly, she has mastered the arcane arts. This is preposterous. Quick and simple. Okay. Are you natural or not? Am I natural or not? She told him, yeah. Bro asked her was she natural or not. She gonna say, am I natural or not? No, I'm Batman. You want to know if I'm natural? Yeah, okay, I'll tell you. You catch me in the back for five minutes, I'll tell you, you're going nowhere. You aren't Batman. Well, of course, Master Bruce. I'm Alfred. Get it? Because my name is Ashley Alfred, not Fredo. Y'all did know that, right? You want to know who I am? Yeah, I'll tell you, okay. My father was an Alfred. He could have named me anything in the world, but no, no. Let's continue this name for an old... Dead white guy. You know, Ritter, you're wrong. I know I know how to seem fierce. Right. Oh! Oh! So that's why they call it a boxer. He haymaking his ass and started weaving on him. Or pink. Pink. Hijo puta. I'm not gonna lie, you got me. You change teams in the middle of the game. Toupe or touche, whatever the hell it is. Well played. Ah, poor child. Why would you smack that chair with your bare hand? Don't you know what goes there? It ain't nothing but snack residue and booty crumbs in that sea. Fecal flakes. Ass ashes. And you acting like you ain't got no damn sense. You could have called Ebola. C-A-P. Child, I think I understand where your frustration coming from. You all right? Come here, come here, come here, come here. Yeah, come, 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 come. Oh, bitch. Yeah. Oh, weaponizing bad hygiene. That's not the place that you think it is. Child, opening a can of tuna in a fist fight is not good sportsmanship. This perk, you gonna think a nigga trip if I fuck you off this perk? I'm gonna have to. Ah, poor child. I hate to rain on your parade, but that ain't no damn accomplishment. You're not a guy, so I ain't expect you to understand, but we be bricked up all the time for no fucking reason. I mean, every morning when we wake up. I'm in this bitch. Most of the time, it ain't even got to be nothing going on. You be in math class, teach us about fractions and shit. Next thing you know. Attention. Oh. <sighs> Child. I thought you had a, uh, <laughs> a wild wand. You know, something to do you, not for a hairdo. I was wrong. I'm gonna go praise him real fast. Won't he do it? I'm actually so crazy. Wait, look what I did. Look, I put L O L. <laughs> You're hilarious. I think you should pursue comedy of some sort. Babe? No. Oh, child. Whew. I am so glad. That is not what I thought it was. White girl takes on BB. You know what? While it was not what I thought, that is still nasty. Ah, uh, child, either you have a tall girlfriend, or that brother's balls are tied up like a hostage situation. Interesting. Hypothetical question. If I was to, um, I don't know, put a different type of meat in the grinder. How do you work a nine to five without being suicidal? You don't, you see, every day I wake up and take that drive to my nine to five, I imagine playing bumper cars with a tree. You know, child, I had no idea what to expect. But that was definitely not it. 360, show 360. You see, this is where I have a problem. When someone says, oh, I want to turn my life around. Well, that only requires them to do a 180. Now, I'm no mathematician, but a 360 would set you on the same path that you are already on. So instead of looking at your backside, we'd be looking at your face and wondering why you're so serious. 
You see, what you're doing with those nails is dangerous. One time, my father told me not to run through the house. They were redoing the floor. But see, me, no, I don't listen. I'm a knucklehead. So uh, I keep doing it, and I end up tearing the bottom of my foot off on a plate of nails. Sounds terrible, right? Well, it's not even the worst. See, there was once a man by the name of Jesus Christ. Does anyone know how to pronounce this road? Oh, child. That's easy. You just have to ignore my accent. But I believe that that is pronounced. Oh, you. Yeah. Ah, this poor child. He must have thought he was Spider Man. Well, hello, dear. Ah, uh, I don't know how to say this, but you busted your ass and you didn't make it. Why don't you worry, child? I'm here to guide your soul to the crossroads. Believe me, because I have the studies to prove it, but people like you more than you think they like you. Oh, is that right? Well, I don't mean to rain on your parade, but there's one small detail that you missed. See, you thought the problem was that people didn't like me, but no, no. See, I don't like people. Uh -oh. Ah, that poor child. Well, poor children. So many lives lost. Ah, that's it. Take your time. Well, hello, dear. I think we're gonna just, uh, take a moment of silence for you and all your fallen soldiers. You were participating in some white people shit, and it ended like some white people shit. But don't you worry, child. I'm here to guide your soul to the crossroads. But lying is never open. <laughs> ah, that poor child. Tried to spread the good word and lost a life. Well, hello, dear. You know, normally I'd tell you to throw some dirt on it, but, uh, sounds like you broke your back in 42 places. I gotta guide your soul to the crossroads. Stop opening your chocolate milk like this. Instead, open it like... Oh, is that right? Well, there's one small problem. My father was a drinker. Milk drinker. But me, no, no, see, I don't like milk. So, what I would do is I take out a knife and say, let's put a smile on that case. Age, divide it by two, and then add seven. This is the youngest, youngest. You know, child, I believe if you find yourself doing a mathematical equation while trying to consider a possible partner, you probably shouldn't be dating them. I told how my boyfriend mom went from hating me to having a threesome with me and her son. Okay, so- Oh, uh, wait a minute, child. Did you just say part two, as in, there was a part one, and then somebody asked for more of a story? No, no, no. You see, your father was absent. Somebody ruin your day. Ruin it yourself. Be a man. <laughs> you see, child. Life is all about perspective. See, on one hand, you see the reason why women live longer than men. And well, on the other hand, it's just a man playing catch with his kids. I grounded my kid and this was his response. Boy! Now see, most of you probably saw that and thought, wow, this kid is going to be a problem. But for me, no, no, see... My mom don't play that. If I was to tear the tags of all the cans in the pantry, I would be eating mystery canned meals for a week. And nothing is worse than green bean breakfast. He asked me to season the meat, so I haven't showered in three days. Madam, this is not how we behave. He said season. You are marinating that motherfucker. Almost making wine. That is no longer a cooch. That is a brewery. Don't talk like one of them. You're not. Even if you'd like to be. To them, you're just a freak. Like me. <laughs> <laughs>